Hello, I'm James Duffy and I'm running for Ward 4 City Councilor. I'm seeking re-election as your Ward 4 Councilor because I believe I can still, uh, with the utmost confidence, fulfill my obligations to all of you as, as your Ward 4 representative. I believe I have the diligence and integrity uh, to serve us all in the best possible way and I believe our most important resource is each other. That's the cornerstone of my uh, tenure so far on the Keene City Council. Three terms at large and one term as your Ward 4 Councilor. I think there's many difficult issues that are happening today that require experience and the ability to think on one's feet, take leadership, but also listen and try to integrate all the varying opinions and facts needed to govern our city in the best way we can. I have been uh, in the last year very busy trying to create initiatives that not only will serve the council but every citizen in Keene and particularly citizens in Ward 4. Ward 4 has very specific issues right now. Uh, the Wheelock Park Master Plan is going to be finished soon. I know many of us have noticed that uh, there have been some improvements made uh, with the infrastructure, the paving and things like that, but there's still a lot of uncertainty. There's a proposed skate park and also uh, probably not as likely uh, to happen as, as soon as the decision is made on, on the skate park, a dog park. We're doing our best to improve parking and to minimize uh, the cost to the taxpayer. I don't know if everybody is aware, but uh, when uh, the, uh, the land in, in what I call the sand pit, a place I miss greatly, uh, walking through with my dogs and also uh, with my family and on my own, uh, that uh, a transformer is being built. Uh, the money of that sale, of that land, uh, through a, an agreement made many years ago, uh, stipulated that the city could not use any proceeds from that sale other than to improve our parks and recreation. Uh, so that money uh, is, is, is being uh, reviewed uh, and how to best be spent. I want the people of Ward 4 uh, to know that I want to listen to all of their concerns and to work as hard as I can to make sure we develop compromises that benefit us all. The other uh, thing that is, is difficult is even though Wheelock Park is in Ward 4. Many, 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 many people uh, take advantage of uh, what's already there. We have softball leagues, we have horseshoe, we have uh, Parks and Rec has soccer, we have volleyball, uh, playgrounds for kids. Uh, we're trying to make it more organized and less stressful to get in and out of there and I think we are succeeding. The other issue I think uh, that is affecting all of us uh, is the heroin epidemic. Uh, I can tell you that I have seen uh, evidence of, of heroin use in Wheelock Park. Uh, I can assure you that law enforcement is aware and doing the best they can to make sure that uh, paraphernalia and most importantly hypodermic needles are not in that park and putting our children at risk or anyone at risk for, for, that, for that matter. Um, there's another issue in Ward 4 I think we need to really start paying more attention to, and that's the impact uh, of the pending uh, closure of Jonathan Daniels School. I know that has been a very difficult process. Uh, the city has not been directly involved, but I believe that uh, as, as time goes on and that date does occur, there's going to be a lot of questions and, uh, and uh, things needed to be answered. Uh, finally, I am uh, very concerned about uh, the flooding that seems to happen uh, very often and I know Maple Acres has, has borne the brunt of that uh, for many, many years and I'm committed to, to trying to uh, find solutions uh, that are cost effective and will help preserve our property values. I also want to say that I'm very, very, very concerned about our tax rate, uh, but I am also, and this is in complete contrast with uh, my opponent, Bob Sutherland, I don't think lower spending is the answer. I think increasing our assessed value uh, is the answer and to continue to spend our money efficiently. 
Uh, I want to thank you. And I think I have a few more seconds. Uh, polling is at November 3rd. Uh, the Ward 4 poll is at Simons Elementary School. If you don't bring your ID, you may have to fill out a form. Um, but please vote on November 3rd.